curtains off Till the lights go out, till my legs give out Can't shut my mouth, till the smoke clears out And my heart progress, I'ma rip this shit Till my bones collapse, till the roof comes off Till the lights go out, till my legs give out Can't shut my mouth, till the smoke clears out And my heart progress, I'ma rip this shit Till my bones collapse, uh. This is your first night at Fight Club. You have to fight. Surprise, Sydney. Something very familiar about all this. What is going on guys, and Eddie here with the first review. Now, the review was uh, Stefan's idea, we talked about it a little bit, and uh, I thought it was pretty cool, so uh, this is it right here. Now, I'm not sure, well, if it's a review like in any, like, uh, let's say, movie or something. Maybe review about our day or something, I don't know. But uh, I'll tell you what I did today. Today was a long day, um, it's like block schedule for testing and everything, good thing I don't take testing because I'm a senior, uh, got signed out early, about like two, two hours in, like, um, two hours uh, before school ended, uh, I went to go get fitted for prom, uh, prom Saturday, uh, last minute, just like last year. I told myself that I wouldn't uh, be late this year, but I am. Um, wasn't that hard? Uh, I just tried on one suit, and there it was. It's uh, my colors are red and gold, so uh, I'll probably send some pictures to uh, Stevan, and maybe I can see him or something. But uh, we have that coming up, and then also on Friday is Fiesta. It's like this thing we do every year, Fiesta de los Guerreros. Uh, it's just like a thing where Pueblo, Pueblo gets together and has like a big old party there. Um, so if you guys aren't doing anything Friday, I'll be working there on my art booth. So you guys can stop by. Um, let's see what else. Nothing much. Uh, we're probably gonna have the SmackDown, my, when I went to SmackDown, uh, we're gonna have it up for you guys, probably this week or next week, depending on when I put up on my channel, um, but, uh, that's pretty much it for my, my review, sorry I wasn't really, uh, prepared, maybe I'll do some, uh, some movie review, movie reviews, um, or game reviews, anything you guys want. But, um, it was cool doing the first review, and, uh, here's a step on. Sounds great, uh, I'm gonna have to try to check that out. Now, uh, I said I was gonna do a review. That's what this whole show's about, reviewing. So I thought I'd review Tomb Raider. We went and saw Tomb Raider the other day, and, uh, it was pretty good, but, uh, it wasn't perfect. To me, it was a good transition from the video game world to the big screen. And I had a few problems with, like, well, in the, in the games, she falls a lot and takes a lot of damage and 
like barely a scratch. That is like copied and pasted in the movie. Like she falls far and hard and not a scratch. She just gets right up and starts running. And like I watched the flick picks uh, review and he hit all the right notes on like what I had to say about like when you're watching it, you kind of waiting for the QTE for like to press X or something so she'll catch herself and she'll like catch herself with the fingertips and me who played the game knows like that's a QTE point but we don't have controllers to try to do that so it just feels kind of out of place but uh yeah so besides that it was a pretty good movie um yeah pretty good edward liked it i liked it the story behind me and edward going to see it was uh we got some passes to go see any movie we wanted just as long as it was two weeks old and uh we already saw black panther so i was like hey tomb raider's out why don't we go see that so we went and saw it uh and it, we enjoyed it it was pretty good and if i had to rank it from like an a plus to an f i think it would be around a minus b kind of so yeah that's that and uh i recently found out sorry for the quick jump ahead but uh for about two weeks i've been having these pains and i've been vomiting and uh i don't want to say it but i was going to the bathroom frequently and i did not know what was going on with me so i went to fast med and they told me that I don't have the flu. I don't have a virus. My body is like adjusting to be lactose intolerant. So I'm trying to cut out all dairy, like cheese, ice cream, milk, sour cream, cream cheese, all that stuff. So I can't have cheeseburgers and I can't have uh, pizza. At least with no cheese. But it kind of feels weird having pizza without cheese. Because it's like a, one of the best ingredients. But yeah. So two weeks of that just non-stop. And I'm still recovering. My stomach is sensitive. And I haven't eaten any dairy. And I feel a lot better than I was. So yeah. And uh. I... I started watching, uh, what should I call it? Uh, I forgot the name. We'll get back to that later. But, uh, as Edward said, he is going to be going to the prom. Now, I probably won't get to do that because I dropped out of high school. Now, I know some people are saying, like, that's bad, but, uh, I dropped out. And I'm going to be going to uh, Pima to get my GED. Yeah, for you guys who don't live here in Arizona, Tucson, Arizona, Pima is Pima Community College. And I'm going to be going there to get my GED. But then after that, I'm going to be uh, just going to college. Probably going for art because I've been really into art lately. Uh, just pretty much all my life, but, uh, yeah, sorry if there's a lot of, but, uh, 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 oh, yeah, uh, it's just how I talk, Edward can verify this, but, yeah, huh, there I go again, um, so, as you guys may know, we've got a new addition to our channel, Matthew, now, he's currently working on a project, I don't know what it is, I don't know what it's about, but he's currently working on that, and I'm very excited to see what it is, and I hope you guys are too, and uh, 
So, what do we talk about now? So, did you guys see the new Infinity War trailer? It looks awesome. Uh, if you guys don't know what Infinity War is about, it's loosely based on the Infinity War Gauntlet comics where Thanos is trying to impress Death. Like, he has this crush on her and he wants her to, like, love him or something like that. And his bright idea is to wipe up, wipe out half the universe. Now, that sucks. And people are saying, like, Cap's gonna be killed, and Iron Man's gonna be killed. To me, when I think of people getting killed, it reminds me of, if you guys have read the comics, when a uh, Thor goes in for an attack, and... I don't know who it is, maybe Proxy. Sorry, I, uh, I had to go charge my phone. It was like on 1%. But uh, back to uh, Infinity Gauntlet. So when Thor is trying to distract Thanos, and I think Proxima Midnight or something like that, someone like that, uh, goes and like stops Thor... And then Thanos notices that Captain America is going in for attack. And he breaks his neck by just backhanding him. I was like, what the heck? That's crazy. But yeah, that that's just what I think about when I hear uh, Infinity Gauntlet. And all that death. To me, I think the most vulnerable person to die is probably Vision. Because he got a freaking infinity stone in his head. And uh, that's that makes him a target for uh, Thanos and the Black Order. And uh, how many of you guys like that, uh, that new iron suit that Spider-Man has? I think it's bad. Uh, not bad as in like, uh, it sucks, that's ugly. I think it looks cool. And uh, people have been... Like, posting pictures of his suit, uh, people are saying that it looks like it's made out of the, uh, I don't know, extremis or uh, bleeding edge, like, technology that Iron Man's new suit is. But yeah, that sounds awesome. But uh, enough about that, you guys probably hear a lot about Infinity War and stuff like that. Uh, but uh, let's go to channel updates. And uh, one update is that we're going to be starting more of these podcasts, a lot more. They're just easier to do, like click record and just dive deep into what we're thinking and stuff like that. So if you guys like that, then uh, subscribe. Uh, but anyways, um, I don't know if you guys enjoyed that like creations thing that me and edward did a little bit ago i had fun i don't know if it was fun for you guys but i mean we're doing things that we love to do and i mean it's not going to be all Fortnite like most of the channels are now but uh we're trying to be different we're like wild cards we one minute we're posting vlogs, the next minute we're posting Fortnite. It's just all over the place. We don't really have a schedule. We say we have a schedule, but we end up changing it. But, uh, yeah. So, that's all I have to talk about right now. I don't know if Edward said everything he needed to say, but I'm going to end it here. So, uh, like, comment, and subscribe for more videos like this or podcasts like this. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Comes off till the lights go out, till my legs give out. Can't shut my mouth till the smoke clears out. And my heart progress, I'ma rip this shit till my bones collapse. Till the roof comes off, till the lights go out, till my legs give out. Can't shut my mouth till the smoke clears out. And my heart progress, I'ma rip this shit till my bones collapse. Uh.